This is a Sparkle Star nail polish tutorial inspired by this week's mood board which I put up every Monday on my blog diamondlifeandstyle.com. So begin by prepping your nails with a smooth base coat. I like this one from Kiko Makeup Milano. And you can use one or two coats. Now we're going to take a light teal color, it doesn't have a number, from Urban Outfitters and we're going to just do in a V shape at the tip of our nails except for our ring finger. We're going to put the color all over our ring finger and this is going to be our fun sparkly nail because sparkling is a good thing. I think that, yeah, I think we can all shine, shine a lot more. So yeah. So now we're going to put number 346. It's a blue color at the top. You can use any color, but I'm kind of going by my inspiration from the mood board. And um, if you make a little bit of a mess, just use a Q-tip to clean it up. That's what I do. Now number 21 T. Leclerc is super sparkly. The ring finger nail has dried and we're going to add that on top. I think it needs more sparkle so after this dries I'm thinking of adding a lot more sparkle. So it looks really cute so far but we got to add some stars. So the stars have fallen from the sky and they are going to fall onto our fingernails. Where else should they go? So just put a clear base coat over your nail one at a time and then with either like an orange stick or a q-tip take one star and put it gently right into the middle of exactly where you want to put it in your nail. I like to put it right in the center. I think it makes a really cute effect and we're going to go over it later with some more clear coat to keep it. Oh look see they get stuck together so be careful with that on the stars. Now with Today Was a Fairy Tale, my favorite Deborah Lipman Silver Sparkle Polish, I'm putting it all over my ring finger. You kind of have to gloop it on a little bit so be careful and let it dry because sparkle polishes you need a lot of sparkles to make them super fun and sparkly. Okay, so this is the finished look and I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. It's easy, it's fun, and it kind of reminds me of a turban. <laughs> Have a great day, guys.